All right, for the last question of this video is, do you have a girlfriend? Y'all been waiting on this video. You too. What's good with y'all boys, man? Today, I got a special video for y'all so I can see from the thumbnail and title. And this ain't no ordinary video. I ain't gonna lie. This one's kind of out of my comfort zone. But I'm trying to get videos out for y'all as quick as possible. So I'm gonna just get this Q&A for y'all. But yeah, as y'all can see from the thumbnail and title, I ain't gonna be giving y'all a Q&A. Now, I ain't gonna lie. I did post on my Instagram. If y'all don't follow me, make sure y'all go follow me on Instagram and on my social. I'm gonna put that down in the link in the description. I'm gonna put it right here. But yeah, I posted like a little um like a little poll on my Instagram talking about should I do a QA. And, and most of y'all said yeah, like a lot of y'all gave me some questions. So this video is basically gonna be about a lot of shit about me basically in this video. Um but yeah, I did post a QA on my I mean I did post a poll on my um story and most of y'all said I want a QA. And a and lot of y'all gave me some questions, so I'm giving that to y'all today. But I ain't gonna lie, y'all niggas. I okay, look, I did post and I was like, y'all give me some crazy questions, but the questions y'all gave me, I think it's what a shame with it. But I'ma still probably um, answer probably like three fourths or most of them in this video. But it's like, but it's good because y'all like my family, so I feel like I'm at the point where I can tell y'all or I should tell y'all about who I am behind this camera and shit like that. But yeah, like I said from the thumbnail and title, I'm gonna give a Q&A for y'all. But make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications so y'all can be notified when I upload. Follow me on all my socials. Make sure y'all um, follow me on Instagram because that's where I communicate with my subscribers the most. And you know a video's gonna drop before it actually drops. But I'm finna drop a video today, like in like an hour or so. But this, y'all probably ain't gonna know because I'm gonna drop this video probably like two days after. But I ain't gonna lie, I appreciate y'all a lot, bro. This like the crate, the support y'all been giving me lately is fucking crazy. But like y'all, y'all just, I'm just lost for words at this point. Y'all, y'all different, bro. I followed y'all a lot. Much love to y'all, but yeah, y'all keep running them fucking numbers up, bro. We gonna be up there the fucking soon, bro. I fuck. I just feel it, bro. Like, YouTube is, like, one thing I've been wanting to do for the longest. But I ain't gonna really talk y'all heads. So I'm just say that for the Q&A. But, yeah, like I said, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications. I really hope y'all enjoyed today's video because this is gonna be a good one. I ain't gonna hold y'all too long. I ain't gonna talk y'all heads. So I'm gonna get straight into today's video. But, yeah, make sure y'all follow me on Instagram so y'all can be, um... So, yeah, this is, like, like I said, that's really where I communicate my subscribers the most. But, yeah, make sure y'all follow me on Instagram so y'all can um, know when I'm going to do videos like this. So, you don't have to miss out or anything like that. But, without further ado, let's hop into today's video. All right, for the first question of the video, or the first, yeah, the first question of this video is, when am I starting my clothing brand? Now, I ain't gonna lie, I was just talking about this, like, yesterday. I was actually, I was, like, um, originally planning on starting my clothing brand next year, like, a 2023 letter beginning. But after I ain't gonna lie, after I bought this camera, like everything about the clothing brand just like just left my mind because y'all starting clothing brands is not easy, y'all. Y'all gotta have a lot of money for that. You gotta have manufacturers. You gotta have it's just a lot of stuff too. You gotta have a name, meaning behind it, fucking logos, all that shit. But that doesn't mean I'm not gonna do it in the future. It is coming soon. But yeah, I actually been wanting to do it for a long time because a brand is something that's something I really wanted to do. But I hear barking in the background, I don't mind that. But yeah, brand is coming soon. Make sure y'all just stay tuned for that. And when I drop this brand, it's not gonna be like no ordinary shit. I'm really gonna actually like I want my shit to be hard. Like I want my my shit to be one on one. I don't want anything that like anybody else got. But yeah, a brand is coming soon. I just y'all just gotta bear with me. I gotta I gotta get the money up and everything. Cause that shit is not cheap. And that shit is not easy. That shit is draining as fuck. But I a brand is coming soon though, I ain't gonna lie. I don't know like how I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I say about around around next year. Y'all keep my word and keep y'all stay with me about that. But I say about around next year I'll start doing it like when I get everything situated. But at, as of right now, I'll say a brand is not like the best for me right now because I have to get everything situated. I gotta get my life and like it's not like I'm living a bad life or anything. I just gotta get what's the word? I gotta get in the right mindset and like in the right situation for me to start a brand right now because yeah, you just gotta have a lot of money for that. I'm trying to tell you, brand is not easy. But yeah, like I said, probably the the beginning or the middle of next year, I start a brand or I have a brand ready for. It. But I am thinking about it right now because I'm trying to like get the name and everything ready. But like that shit is not easy, y'all. But yeah, like I said, I'm gonna do it. I ain't really gonna get into that. I'm like I said, I'm gonna um I'm gonna give y'all more information about that um in like another video. But yeah, I'll say about next year, I'm gonna have a brand. 
But yeah, that's the answer to that question. On to the next question. All right, for the next question of this video is, how old am I? Now, if y'all don't know, my birthday was last month. I was 15 last month, and I just turned 16 on October 14th. I ain't really that old. If people say I look old because of my my uh, my facial hairs and my like my face structure, my height and everything, but I'm just a 16 year old young man, bro. I ain't that old. I ain't like 19 or anything. But yeah, I'm 16. I remember I first got my job at McDonald's, bro. It was like I walked in. I was 15 years old. It was like ain't no way you fucking 15. You look 17. And you know at McDonald's, if y'all don't know at McDonald's, you gotta wear like a red hat. I was wearing a red hat. My manager was like, why is he wearing a red hat? Ain't he like 17? But yeah, I'm just a young 16 year old. 16 i'm not 15 not 17 16 i'm not anything older or younger than that but yeah i'm just 16 16 young but yeah that's that question on to the next one all right for the next question of this video is do i miss my ex no i do not miss my ex and the reason is because no i just don't miss my ex i ain't really gotta get too deep in that but i do not miss my ex y'all i mean like all right, I'm gonna say what I'm finna say for like the next or like the last question of this video because I'm gonna give y'all a reason why I don't miss my ex. But no, nah, I really don't miss my ex. It's not like no bad blood or anything between me and her. But it's like I guess we cool, but it's not nothing. But we ain't no bad blood between her. But I won't say I miss her. It's like this can go two ways. It's like do I miss her as like as like a person or like, do I miss her being in a relationship with? Her? But no, nah, not not in a relationship, not really. But. Yeah, man, I ain't got no bad blood between her. But yeah, that's that question. On to the next question. All right, for the next question of this video is, what's my main goal in this YT shit? Now, I'm glad you asked that. I ain't gonna lie, I'm gonna tell you who to ask the question. My boy Vine, if y'all know um, Vonster, y'all probably don't know who it is, but I had put him in. He's one of my bros that on the YouTube. But he asked me, what's my main goal with, with this YT shit? Now, I ain't gonna lie, YouTube is probably this has probably been one of my goals or my dreams since this has probably been one of my dreams to do since like i was in elementary school damn near like fourth grade fifth grade i don't know i just grew up watching youtube i'm not one of them people to just watch netflix and everything i love watching youtube i love watching just i don't know it's just something about youtube I and mean, like my favorite people to watch is on youtube so that's why i don't, I don't know how to explain it but i've been wanting to do youtube for the longest and i know one day i'm gonna just be up there like with the biggest YouTubers of all time type shit. I know I'm gonna be big one day. But, yeah, I've been wanting to do YouTube since like fourth grade. And now, well, if y'all don't know, I did start off with YouTube doing, I think it was, it was gaming. No, no, I wasn't gaming. I started off YouTube doing IRL and shit. And then I had switched over to like gaming and shit, like Fortnite and everything. That's when Fortnite was popping and everything. I was like, I was actually decent, to be honest. I was actually good. If y'all watch my Fortnite videos, y'all know. But yeah, I started off YouTube doing, um, Fortnite and IRL videos and all that shit, but now I won't really take it serious. But now I'm actually taking it serious because I can actually see myself. I can actually see myself like on a big platform and getting myself to where the point where I want to be in YouTube. But yeah, my biggest goal is well, this year of right now is probably getting. I want to have at least 50k subs by the end of 2024, 2023. I know we're gonna get it, bro. It's gonna take a long time, but I know we're gonna get it, but. I love I love YouTube, bro. This is like my biggest dream. I even told myself I wasn't going to college because I, I knew I, I won't. I know it's not no thing. I know I'm gonna be big on YouTube, so I don't know if I'm going to go to college. But it's like a 50-50. But we getting off top. It ain't nothing about college. But yeah, YouTube is one um, one of the dreams that I've been wanting to do for the longest, and I know I'm gonna uh, keep doing. It. I'm gonna continue to do it. Make sure y'all just stay tuned. But we're gonna be big one day. But yeah, YouTube been one of my goals for the longest, so that's why I'm still into it, and that's why I'm dedicated to it. But yeah, that's that. On to the next question. All right, for the next question of this video was, what's the weirdest thing I got caught doing? Let me think. I don't really know. I'm not, I don't think I really, I don't know if you're referring to like sexual wise or like, I don't know, because I don't think I never got caught doing anything weird. I don't really know. Well, if I if I have, I really it, it's not coming to mind right now. But I don't think I never got caught doing anything weird because I don't know. But yeah, I didn't really got caught doing anything weird, so I don't really even know how to answer that question. But on to the next question. All right, for the next question of the video, it's like the similar question to the last one. It's like, when was the moment that you realized you wanted to do YouTube? Now, like I said, I want I started YouTube. Well, I've been wanting to do YouTube since elementary school, and. 
when I started, I got like a big friend group. Shout out to them. I got like a big friend group. And I'm like, I don't know. I got, I got a big friend group, but they're not into YouTube. They're like into other shit. But they're like, they're like good. They're like good. Um, They support me and what I do. Like we all support each other. But that's besides the point. I, um, or my bad. My mom did call me. But the uh, question was, when was my mom, when was the moment that I realized I wanted to do YouTube? Now, like I said, it was, this is like related to the other question. Now, I, like I said, I did want it to, I've been wanting to do YouTube since I was like in elementary school. But the moment I realized I wanted to do it is like, or if y'all don't know the, the YouTuber Poppy Q or Quan, whatever y'all want to call it, he's like group Cozy Mafia. When he had, I think it was when he first, when he first moved out, when he first got his Hellcat or some shit. And I'm like, I was just looking at his videos and he was giving like speeches and shit or like, like how manifestation worked and all that. And I'm like, bro, okay. I'm just, I'm just chill on that. Like, I, that, like, went in this ear and went out the other. So, I'm like, okay. This nigga got a Hellcat. We already know he got money and everything. But he had got a Hellcat. Boom. And then he had got a fucking house. And then he had got a crib. And then he just been getting Hellcats and other cars and all that shit. At the, um, just, like, as time going by and this shit. And this nigga was just like, um, manifestation is real. And I'm like, bro, now that I think about it, all this shit, all this money. Well, I don't really know, but all this money is mostly coming from YouTube and his brand and everything. I'm like, bro, if he can do that shit, I know I can do that shit. Not saying I'll compare my grind to his, but that's how most YouTubers is. Like, I don't know, bro. YouTube is just one thing I've been wanting to do for the longest, but that's really not how to put it. But yeah, Quan is one of my biggest inspos. But yeah, but like, like I said, this nigga came from fucking doing videos in his room like I'm doing now. To fucking in penthouses, Hellcats, track halls, all that shit. So I'm like, if he can do that, I know I want to live that lifestyle. If he can do that, I know I can do that. But yeah, that's really the moment I realized I, realized I want to do YouTube. But yeah, that's that. On to the next question. All right, for the next question of this video is, what influenced your style? Now, I really don't know how to answer this question. How do I answer this? I don't know how to answer that. Cause I don't know if you like saying who influenced my style or what. I don't know. Okay, look. After coming out of the eighth grade year, I actually wanted to change my style up because I was just dressing like everybody else, like wearing fucking forces, jeans, and a hoodie. That was getting boring to me. So I'm like, okay, let me try something different. I'm coming. Out, I want to come out of my comfort zone. I like. I want my confidence level to be at a certain like a like a level to where the point where nobody can tell me that anything I got on is ass because you know I'm not gonna give a fuck. But after coming out of the eighth grade year. I was like, let me try something different. I want to see if I like it and everything. Like, I want to change my style up to see. I'm basically, if you think I found my style because I'm still, like, like in the moment of, like, um, finding things that I like. Yeah, after I came out of 8th grade, I just want to change my style up to see, like, what I like. Because I didn't want to just dress like everybody else. And, like, now that I can actually stop. The shit that I wear now, I'm actually glad that I did it because I, everything that I got now, I actually like it. People actually compliment me every day, not saying the compliments matter or like everybody's opinions matter. But yeah, I actually like my style now. I'm not saying I found it because I'm still working on it. But for the next question of this video is, what you doing when you hit 10K? I don't know if you're talking about $10,000 or 10K subscribers. But when I had my first 10K, I you know I'm buying a car. But if you're talking about subs, when I find my first 10K, I'm probably gonna splurge on some fucking shoes or some shit to like spoil myself for like as a reward because hitting my first 10K, that's a lot of fucking people. A thousand people, I got a thousand, what, 900 and 1.19K or something like that. That's already a lot of people to me right now. So just imagine how much 10K is gonna be for me. But yeah, that's that uh, answer to that question. For the next question of this video is Have I ever ate but? No, I would never eat ass. That shit is no. Bro, why did you even ask? No. Have I ever ate ass? No. And I would never eat ass. That shit is no. Fuck no. For the next question of the video is what's your goals in life? Like I said, I want to be big on YouTube. Start a brand. Uh I'm not saying I want to rush moving out my mom's crib at the at a certain age, but I do want to move out my mom's crib because that's like a big step, like step in life, and that's a big goal that I want to do. Because I can actually finally say that I'm living on my own, meaning that it's gonna it's gonna take a cool minute to get there. I mean, I'm gonna have to work my ass off, so that's like a, that's like another go to. I want to have a car by the time I want to have a car by the beginning of my junior year. As I know, I am a sophomore, 
But yeah, I wanna have a car by the end of my junior by the beginning of my junior year. And what else? My biggest goal of this year right now is I wanna hit 2K by the end of fucking I wanna hit the 2K by the by the beginning of 2023. That's my main four goals right there. But yeah, for the next question of this video is by what age do you wanna touch down with at least 40k? I don't know, because I don't know what the future holds for me, but I want to I wanna at least be like, well, I want to hit 40K by the, before I'm like 20, in my 20s, damn near, like 25. I don't really know what kind of question that is, but, but yeah, for the next question of this video is, have I ever snuck out? Did you get caught? Tell us what happened. Yes, I've snuck out multiple times. I've never got caught. I don't think I saw. I've been scared as fuck though. Like every time I, every like the times I snuck out, I've been scared as fuck. I hope my mom not watching this video. But I haven't snuck out in a minute. Though. I like my mom's actually cool with me going places now. Now I'm getting older and everything. But when I have the times I snuck out, I don't think I've ever got caught. I don't know if you mean like going out to like a girl house or anything. But every every time I sneak out, I've never got caught. But like when I was a kid, like sneaking out with my brother, most likely. But he would get in trouble because I'm falling out the film. But it's like I mean, it's like his idea. Well, he would get more in trouble than me. That makes sense. But no, nah, I don't think I never got in trouble. All right, for the next question of this video. Now, this shit is like crazy. Like, what the hell? Have you ever robbed a store or someone asking this count? Tell us what happened. Have I ever robbed someone or have I ever robbed a store? No. I don't know if you mean robbed like gunpoint. Nah, I've never robbed somebody. I've never did that. I feel like robbing or taking anything from someone else is like, that's not me. I'd rather go get that shit on my own, to be honest. But... I would never take anything from my, no one because I don't want that shit happening to me. But no, I would never rob. I would never do that, and I've never, I've never did that before. But yeah, I, that answers the question. All right, for the next question of this video, who is my favorite ex? I don't think I really have a favorite ex because I'm not trying to be like, like cocky or anything, but like I don't know. Every time I'm gonna like a relationship, I feel like it's not me, it's always the female. If y'all get what I'm saying, if y'all know, y'all know. But, who is my favorite ex? I don't think I got any, to be honest. I don't have a favorite ex. Nah, I don't, no. Nah. I don't think I got a favorite ex, y'all, to be honest. Like, no bullshit. But, yeah, I don't think I got a favorite ex. I'm trying to think if I do, because my favorite ex, if I was to have one, it was probably my last relationship. Which was last year, I think. I think that was probably my favorite days. If not, yeah, that was probably my favorite days if I say so. If I do say so myself. Are right, multiple people done asked this question? I'm just answering because I've been avoiding it because I wanted to save it for like the end. But for the next question of this video, I want y'all to just guess what it is, bro. Am I a virgin? Now, let me tell y'all. I'm not really gonna give y'all an answer, but I, I whatever y'all think I am is the answer. Go, is really gonna be the answer gonna be because, yeah. Do y'all think I'm a virgin? Do y'all think I'm not? Do y'all think I fuck for? What's up, y'all? Whatever, whatever y'all want, want it to be. But is that the last question? It's like some other question, but like they're like the same as the other one. Like, are you a virgin? Do I miss my ex? When did I lose my virginity? How old am I? Type shit. I'm just get to the main question because this is like. The last question of the video, and like four people not asked this. Y'all ready? Last question of today's video is I know this QA was kind of short, but last question of the video was Do I have a girlfriend? Now, yes, y'all, I do have a girlfriend, but let me tell you, okay, so I think she came over, what was it, Tuesday? She had came over Sunday, and I was like recording, like trying to do a video where. But at the moment, she says she's not comfortable with being on YouTube or with me having a camera out around her. But yes, y'all, I do have a girlfriend. Y'all let me know if y'all want to see vids with her because I was trying to get her involved. But she said she wasn't comfortable yet, which I respect. I'm not going to force her to be in any vids because, yeah, I'm just not that type of person. I'm not going to force her to be in vids. But yes, I do have a girlfriend, as y'all know. If I follow me on Instagram, y'all would know. But yes, I do have a girlfriend. Everybody been asking me that question for the longest. But yes, I do have a girlfriend. She is a year older than me. If y'all if y'all go back in the video, I said I'm 16, so y'all do the math. But yeah, she is a year older than me, and yes, I do have a girlfriend. 
And like I said, I was recording and I was going to post, but I had to ask her first to make sure she wouldn't be in the video. She said she wants to come to me in the video yet. So, but yeah, if you follow me on Instagram, y'all would know and see everything because I post it down there every time she with me. But yeah, yes, y'all, I do have a girlfriend. I am in a relationship, y'all. So, any girls, don't hit me up. I got a girl. Tight shit. But yeah, that is gonna wrap it up for today's video. I'm pretty sure I don't think I got any more uh, other questions. But yeah, if y'all wanna see a part two, if y'all wanna see like a, yeah, if y'all wanna see a part two, I can definitely get a part two off y'all because I like telling y'all who I am personally. But yeah, if y'all wanna see a part two, make sure y'all let me know. It can be a damn juicy QA, fucking freaky ass questions. It don't, got, it don't matter. No gay shit. I get it out for y'all because at this point, I'm like ready to just push out any videos type for y'all. I'm ready to push out any type of videos for y'all because I'm like getting comfortable using my camera. And now that I got good quality, bro, it's like pushing me to like want it to upload more. But after this video, I might do another video. Y'all say y'all wanted to shoot collection. Like I said, I did post a poll on my story. Make sure y'all go follow me on Instagram because that's where I like do all my polls on like what videos I should post and what videos y'all want to see. But yeah, people said they want to see a shoe collection. So I might go record a video after this one. But yeah, that's besides the point. Like I said, that is going to wrap it up for today's video. I really hope y'all enjoy. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications so y'all can be notified when I upload. I ain't going to stress this enough. Make sure y'all go follow me on Instagram. That's where I communicate with my subscribers the most. And you know when videos going to drop before it actually drops. But... I ain't really gonna hold y'all too long. Let me know if y'all want a part two. Comment down in the um, comment section or DM me on Instagram what type of videos y'all wanna see. Like I said, I'll get it out for y'all. But yeah, I ain't really gonna talk y'all heads. I'll keep y'all too long. Love y'all boys. Appreciate y'all for all the support. Rocking out shit is enough. 2K is on the way. But I ain't gonna talk y'all heads off. With that being said, I'm out.